how you, we're going to see how to use blur effects on KDE Plasma Desktop, especially on Debian or Ubuntu based distributions. First of all, go to System Settings, then go to Window Management, click on KVN Scripts, then Get New Scripts, search by Rating. Here you can see the force blur script. You can even search by the name of this script. It doesn't matter how you do. Then click install. This script is installed. Let's close out of that. Here you can see the force blur script and here is this configuration icon. For most of you, this icon won't be available. To make this icon available, what you need to do is go to your web browser, let's launch Firefox, then search Force Blah GitHub. The first one from the search result, which is the GitHub page of the Force Blur script, ESG on. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Sorry about that. Click on that. This is the GitHub page of the script. Here's the readme. First of all, make sure that your system has the minimum requirements or the full requirements to use this script. Operating system Kubuntu 18.10 Neva, Fedora 29 on Neva, Arch Linux, Kwin 5.14 on Neva. Make sure you're using Blur desktop effect which can be enabled through system settings I'm gonna show you how to do that real quick go to system settings then window management desktop effects search for blur here's the blur I already have it enabled so I have the check if it isn't enabled in your system, you can enable it by checking it. After checking it, then go to the configure icon. The default looks like this. What you need to do is reduce the noise strength to zero, then reduce the blur strength to almost 50%, then click OK. Then uncheck it apply check apply after that this is not really necessary but it's fun search for translucency then here you can see I have already activated translucency you can also do that then go to the configure icon you can customize it like I have done it as you can see I've made this windows kind of transparent uh, semi-transparent so when I use the blur effects I can see the blurs being used click on ok then as you guys already know uncheck uh, apply on the check then apply then let's close out the settings after that you can see that the script internally calls xprop command which would be already installed on your system x11 display server the script does not support well end applications we already know that well end does not support a lot of things then how to use install the script we have already installed the script 
then run the following in terminal to enable script configuration. This is the most important part. As I said before, I have already done this. That's why I have the configuration icon on the settings menu. But if you don't have that configuration icon, you'll have to do this step. First of all, copy this, then open up your terminal, then paste this. After pasting it, click enter. You should be good to go now. After that, let's close out of your browser. Go to system settings, then Kwini scripts here enable the force bear script once again then you will see this configure icon click on that and write the window class names one per line the instructions are given here as you can see I have a lot of the class names of the applications that I use for example, VLC, MPV, Kate, Console, Vivaldi, Nemo, Kitty, System Settings 5. Oh, uh, the official name or the window class name of the system settings is System Settings 5 in KD Plasma 5. Then Kvanta Manager, Dolphin, Keepa Sexy, URXVT, Yakuyake, etc. etc. Then just click OK and you should be using the blur effects by now. If you can't see the blur effects even now, just restart your computer and it should be good to go. So guys, that's it for the video. If you found it helpful, please leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.